Hey everyone, welcome back to Tenorshare. I know some of your guys must be using the new iPhone 14 or 14 Pro. The dynamic island design is great. I can't live without it. But have you guys met the situation that your iPhone 14 black screen somehow? I did. My iPhone 14 Pro will suddenly black screen during daily use. I don't know why. So I check it out. I check out three ways that you should try on if you've got the same issue. Let's go. Before we start, you need to make sure that your iPhone 14 black screen is not caused by hardware damage and also not because of running out of power. So charge your iPhone 14, charge for at least 30 minutes, and then we can proceed. Method 1. Force Restart iPhone 14 When there is a bug happens on your iPhone, you should try Force Restart. So press the volume up and press the volume down and then press and hold the power button. Keep pressing till the Apple logo appears. If your iPhone didn't respond, or it goes back to black screen, then it might be the iOS system went wrong. You need to update or restore it. Method 2. Fix iPhone 14 black screen with Tenorshare Reiboot. This is an iOS system repair tool. It can fix more than 150 plus iOS issues, including iPhone black screen, Go check the download link in the description and download it. Once installed, connect your iPhone to a PC or Mac and open Reiboot. If Reiboot does not detect your iPhone 14, then you need to put it in recovery mode first, with the force restart move, but this time holding a little bit longer. Keep holding till the recovery mode screen shows up. Click the green start button. Choose standard repair. Here will require to download the match firmware to repair your iPhone 14, just click it. It won't be long, depending on your network condition, be patient. Once download is OK, click Start Standard Repair. The repair process will take some time in order to repair your iPhone properly. Please be patient and do not disconnect your iPhone during the process. Then it is done. You can see my iPhone 14 is back to its normal state again. I can access it without any problem, and none of my data is lost. Go give it a try. If you prefer to use iTunes, you can follow the next method. Method 3. Fix iPhone 14 black screen with iTunes or Finder. First, connect your iPhone 14 to a PC or Mac. Then open iTunes or Finder. Here I will use iTunes. Now you need to put your iPhone in recovery mode first. Press the volume up and the volume down button, then press and hold the power button. Keep pressing till the support interface shows up. If your iPhone didn't show the support interface, just go check iTunes. Then you will see iTunes pop up a window, choose update here. Wait for the iTunes download complete and it will start to update your iPhone. The process might take a long time. You need to be patient. Then you can see my iPhone 14 is back to its normal state, but I do meet a failed situation before. So I still recommend you use method 2, way faster and less error. Okay, that's it. Hope this video is helpful to you. I'll be grateful if you subscribe. Stay tuned for our next videos.